Yo, what is up everybody? Jumping here on. I'm back with my soul level 1 challenge run for Dark Souls. Alright, we need to hop off and grab the soul of the brave warrior. And we are going to try to defeat the centipede boss. And then we are going to Lost Isolus. And hopefully we can defeat the bed of chaos. So that is the plan for this episode. Let's hope we can do it. In our last episode, we defeated the four kings. Which was fucking epic! Yeah, yeah. Oh man, took some damage. I'm not gonna summon Solaire. We're just gonna go for it. Now, I'm gonna try something. I'm still not too sure if it's possible, but I'm gonna try it anyway. I'm gonna try to use combustion on this guy. I don't think that you can do that, but let's jump. Oh my god! The lava does so much damage! Holy shit, man! I need to be extra careful. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh! Fuck! Holy fuck, man. That was crazy! Urgh. Okay, let me not jump through it. Jumping through it is stupid. I need to roll through it. Alright, we need to run all the way over here. Heal and just go. Otherwise, he's gonna come up behind us and fuck us up. Come on! Alright, that worked. That worked a lot better. Oh, man, I might need 10 potions for this fight. Let's go ahead and heal. I don't know, though. Maybe I don't need 10 potions because it seems like if he hits me, I'm fucking dead. And that always sucks. Oh, man. Are right, we going to try combustion. You would think that it would never work, and I probably look really stupid. If it doesn't work, I'm going to look really, really stupid. Oh, my God. Okay. We're going to have to dodge that. Come on, yeah, do that stupid thing. We coming in. Ugh. Stop, stop! Get on the damn fucking ground. Okay, yeah, it, yeah, it doesn't work. So, I feel stupid. I feel like one of those kids that would hit the smelter. Oh, shit, I can't see. There's so many kids that would try to hit the smelter team and would fire. You're like, really? Really? Come on. Here we go. Ugh. Gotta back off. Let's go. Let's go! Fuck, I fucked up. What's he doing? I don't even know what attack that was. Man, this lightning is fucking... <gasps> no! I tried to go for that jump attack. That was stupid. Alright, jump! Yeah, that's how you finish him off. That's what I'm talking about. Alrighty, that wasn't too bad. And we got a ring now, so let's go ahead and equip that thing so we can just go. Thank you for the homeward boner. Oh, man. So the plan is to basically get to Lost Isolus and beat the Bed of Chaos. I'm trying to think. I don't know if I really want to go and fight Solaire or if I want to rescue the Onion Knight. Well, he's not the Onion Knight. That's I say that now because of Game of Thrones. I really love that guy on Game of Thrones. The Onion Knight, the one with Stannis. He's such a badass. What? Hello. Feel sorry for you, bro. You're going to die, unfortunately for you. You know what, though? I am definitely going to go and fight Solaire because I can get the Sunlight Maggot and I can use that for when I go to the Tomb of the Giants. So I'm definitely going to go do that. I might not do the Onion Head thing just because that one really doesn't matter. I don't really need anything down there. I don't need Red Titanite Chunks. I don't need the Red Titanite Slab. So fuck it. All right. We need to be extra careful here, because these, like, dinosaur things. I don't know if I pointed this out in my last playthrough, but if you look at those things, they have, like, no front. Like, they have no head. In fact, they really have no upper body. It's just their legs and their tail. That's all it is. It's really weird. It's crazy, man. Alright, so let's come over here, grab this item. You have to be careful running through the lava, because your gear can break. It sucks. But if your gear doesn't have much stability, the chance of it breaking is very high. Like, if you're running around in this lava with, like, 
Havel stuff, you're not going to have any problems. It's not going to probably break. But if you're running around in this shit with, like, the Wanderer's coat and the crap that I have, then, yeah, you're going to have some problems. Urgh, bitch. It's crazy how much damage that jump attack does compared to the normal attack. It's insane. Alright, we need to get that soul of a great hero. Oh, shit. Where is it? I guess it's over here. Yeah, it is. Leave me alone, big fuckers. I do want this, though, just so I can use it. Yeah, I'm gonna have to figure out what to spend my souls on. I don't know. I was spending it on my pyromancy. Ow. I was spending it on my pyromancy flame, but I maxed that out now, so. Oh, God! Oh, God! At least I died on the ground. That's good. I don't know if you guys have ever had this happen to you before, but if you ever die in the lava, it is almost impossible to actually find your souls. I swear. Like, I have died so many times in that lava, and I'm like, alright, I know where I died. I died over there. So I'll go back over there, and I'm like, where's my souls? And I'm just running around looking for them, and I just can't find them. It's so annoying. So if you do die on this part, which is actually kind of rare. I haven't died on this part in a long time. But if you do die on this part, make sure to die on the ground or somewhere that is like solid. Because you're not going to have the problem of needing to find out where your fucking souls are. I got screwed over because I aggroed that dude. And when I aggroed him, he basically, you know, came at me and... Stomped, stunned the shit out of me, stomped again, stunned the shit- it, Basically, he just stunned the shit out of me, that's what happened. But it's whatever. Let's go. Alright. My souls should be, like, right here. Yeah, there they are. See, even when they're on the ground, it's hard to see. It, you know what it is? It's the reflection off that lava. Ah, man. Graphically, this part- it's just so insane. It really is. Like, whoever designed this area and they actually programmed it, fucking beautiful, man. Absolutely crazy. Hurts your fucking eyes, though. So that's kind of lame, but whatever. All right, hop down. We're going to get the bonfire real quick. There's a hidden wall over here. Let's go ahead and light that bad boy up and rest at it. Honestly... If I can do this part quickly, I might be able to go do something else. I'm trying to think. Is there anything that is really short I can do? Because I don't want to, like, commit to a long area. I like to do the long areas all in one episode, you know? That's always fun. I already did the Stray Demon. That's a quick one. Yeah, I don't think there's... Honestly, I might just have to end the episode after the Bed of Chaos, you know? If, especially if I can get lucky and actually get past it on my first attempt. There's always that chance that I'm not going to get lucky and I'm going to get screwed over and I'm going to die, I'm going to die, I'm going to die. Honestly, if that thing hits me, it's probably going to one-shot me, so that's something I'm really going to have to watch out for. And I don't know what strategy I'm going to go for yet. I think I might have to do the quitting strategy. That might be the best thing to do for the Soul Level 1 playthrough. Because... Generally, if I don't do the quitting strategy, I'm gonna get hit by the bed of chaos. Getting hit, like I said, is probably gonna end up killing me, so... I think what would be best is to probably run, hit one of the things, quit, run, hit one of the things, and quit. And just go like that. Fuck you, bitch. Come on, drop something for me. Drop something for daddy. Oh, shit. That's my new thing, by the way, guys. Um... I don't know why I do it, but I just think it's hilarious, personally. Oh, you know what? I can't be invaded here. I'm not human. No! Oh my god! Alright, let's try not to get screwed over this time. Fuck you! Oh no, 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 no! Ah! Uh, no! The lava! The lava! Oh, thank God. Run away. 
Holy fuck, the damage is real! Oh god! Oh no. Bitch. What is up? Yeah, get smacked in the face. And you are dead. Ha ha. Give me your shit. Alrighty. Oh my god, I got 150,000 souls. That's not good. That is really not good. Especially if I die on the bed of chaos. Oh no. Generally, that's a huge mistake. Okay. Kill this motherfucker. Open this bad boy up. Grab that. And I think we are good. Now we need to go and fight Solaire real quick. I'm just gonna combustion his ass. You know, in fact, I could have been combusting all these enemies here. Well, not the fire ones, clearly, but the other ones, like Kurt. Alright, let's come down here now. Oh yeah, what I was saying before though, before I, I like got totally destroyed by the firestorm, is that that's my new thing. And if you guys, if you guys really want to have a really funny and awkward conversation with people you don't really know, new people you meet, just do do this, all right? Because like of YouTube, I meet a lot of people. You know, people hit me up, and I'll talk to a lot of people just because you know I like talking to people. Like it's fun. Oh my god. Like, I have fun talking to people, you know, like, and I don't really mind it all that much. So, a lot of times people will hit me up, maybe they'll give me a private chat invite, and I'll just accept it, and they'll be like, Oh, shit, you joined! Like, I, I, I didn't expect you to join! I'm like, nah, man, it's all good, it's cool. I'm not even gonna kill that thing, I don't even care. But, um, one thing I have been doing recently is I'll, I'll basically say, like, uh, you know, yeah, um, you know, uh, you know, yo, just ca call me daddy. <laughs> and it just makes it so awkward. And they're like, what? R really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ca call me daddy. A and then, um, then what you do is that you start to ref- Oh, oh God! He's not dead! Fucking Solaire. Oh, God! Alright, so, I don't know what it is, but this game really doesn't want me to finish what I'm talking about. Anyway, yeah, so that's my new thing. I just tell people that I don't know. Oh my god, how am I getting destroyed by that? I just tell people that I don't know, you know, call me daddy. And then, what I do, and I'm just saying you guys could do it too, if you just really want to, like, have an awkward, funny conversation with someone that you just met. You can, you know, tell them that you're just fucking around after the fact. But then refer to yourself as daddy in the third person. And it just makes it so much better, you know? <laughs> you just keep it going. <laughs> so, I mean, I don't know. This is like my new stupid thing I've been doing recently. Oh, God, Solaire. Oh, God, Solaire! I didn't recover either! Solaire, you are such a little bitch! Locking on to the fucking stupid little bugs. This is why I didn't want to fight you! Oh, no! <laughs> Oh my souls! Die! Ha ha! Nice. Alright guys, so I went ahead and I put the wolf ring on. Hopefully that doesn't screw me over, but... Oh my souls, man! Fuck! What happened though was he hit me, he stunned me, and then he fucking finished me off. I couldn't move. So I need the wolf ring to not ha let that happen again, so I can get away from him if he hits me. There's all these little fucking targets everywhere, man! Lock on to Solaire! Dude. Dude. Oh, he just wants to hit me so bad. Just fucking die! I'm sorry, bro. But you are OP as shit! Give me all your shit. God damn! I mean, he is OP! Fucking OP! Alright. Let's get the fuck out of here. Go fight the Bed of Chaos now. I can't believe I lost 150,000 souls. It's not like I really had much to use it on, though. I mean, I was kind of complaining about that anyway. Like, what am I going to use my souls on? 
But still, it just sucks. Every time you lose a lot of souls, you just get so mad. Oh, it's so frustrating. Especially when you lose it like that. Honestly, in the future, I'm never ever again when I'm playing this game or Dark Souls 2. I'm, oh shit, I'm getting stuck. I'm never ever again gonna just try to talk about some random fucking bullshit story of me being awkward with people I don't know. Because that's just like, I don't know what it was. It was fucking a curse. I bring it up and I get fucking murdered every time. Alright, let's run over here. And let's fucking do this. Alright, so, I'm gonna do the quitting strategy, so... Oh, fuck. I hate it when I do that. I use a pop filter, and sometimes it, I fuck up because I accidentally touch it, and then it makes, like, a fucking really ridiculous noise on the mic, so I'm sorry if you guys just heard my mic go crazy there. I've noticed that, too. Like, sometimes I'll accidentally touch it when I'm doing these commentaries, and I can hear it. Okay, let's go. So, I'm sure you guys have heard it too before in the past where you hear like just this weird sound as I'm talking. It's because I'm touching my mic somehow. Alright, let's go, let's go. Anyway, what I was about to say though is that I'm gonna have to edit this like crazy. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, okay. I can survive that, that's cool. We're just gonna go, we're just gonna go, we're just gonna go. Oh god, oh no, god, fuck! All right, try this shit again. Oh, man. Normally, you want to block that, but with my low amount of stamina and the low amount of stability on this shield, I don't think that's really going to make a difference. We'll see. Maybe I'll take a little bit less damage, but if he knocks me back, he knocks me back. I mean, that's just the way it is. Here we go. Fuck, I, I was blocking. Oh, God, I'm dead again. Watch. I don't have to roll! Oh my god! The same fucking shit just happened! Oh my god. <sighs> Fuck. This is gonna be really fucking annoying. I can already tell. Well, I have no fucking souls for the most part, so fuck getting the souls over there. I'm going on the left. Let's try the fucking left. Oh my god. Piece of shit fucking tree. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Left is always so much easier. Oh hell yeah. That was super simple. But it's gonna be harder getting there on the right. Come on. There we go. Fuck. Skip that shit. Alright, I'm quitting out. Alrighty. So we're back in now. This time we have to run to the right. You know, this is a very good strategy though, guys. If you ever have trouble with the bed of chaos, just run to one, hit it, quit out, and it resets basically. You spawn outside the door, and then you run to the other one, you hit it, you quit out, and then you run down the middle. Alright, this is gonna suck. Total fucking ass. Oh god. Oh no. Oh god! And I actually thought this would be a short episode. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. I should have known better. Why do I ever open my big fat fucking mouth? <sighs> Alright, let's go. This time, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna let him swing, and then I'm gonna go. That's what I need to do. Fuck it, my blood stain. I don't even care. Come on. Come on, bitch. Yeah, swing. Oh, I'm the fucking shit, motherfucker! Oh, man. You know what's funny? I was watching uh, Sunlight, Sunlight Blade's video, and somebody actually brought me up in the comments and saying that they don't like me because I act like I'm, I'm so good and I'm not. And I'm like, when the fuck do I ever say that? I always say I suck ass, like right now. I suck ass! All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's try to go, Elise. Uh, I'm fucked! No, no, no. I, I think I got lucky. Oh, God. We gotta go. We gotta go. Where's my fucking weapon? Let's go. Let's fucking go. Come on. Ugh. All right. We're good. Yeah, guys. But I suck ass. That's all I have to say. 
Alrighty. All we gotta do is make it now. We just gotta make it. We can do this. We can do it. Honestly, I haven't even died that much on this guy, but I just know how much of a nightmare it is. And running back is just so fucking tedious, man. Oh, so annoying. Alright, let's go. Come on. Swing, motherfucker, swing! Yeah, there you go. Swing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go! Let's go! No! <laughs> oh, man. If you guys don't like Rage, you probably have already disliked this video and stopped watching. Holy shit. That was so fucking cheesy. I mean, how much more cheese can you get than that? Fucking crazy, man. I made it, but yet his arm pushed me. Oh, oh, God! Alright, come on, man. Swing. Swing! Alright, we gotta back up! Oh, shit. No, not that. I need him to do the other attack. The other attack's better. There it is. Oh, God. Oh, God. Don't hit me. Alright, let's go. Let's go. You always want to get on this little side thing. Ah, we made it. All right, let's go. Let's go. The fire can kill me. Come on, roll. Roll, motherfucker, roll. Don't have much stamina, but whatever. Let's go. 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 Yes. Yes, yes. We go to jump for joy and kill this motherfucker. No, 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 no. Well, he's dead. That's good. Well, alright guys, I guess I'm gonna end the episode. I don't even think I'm gonna go get those souls. I don't fucking care. I really don't. I'm just glad that's fucking over with. I wonder how the rest of the great lords or great souls are gonna go. Because thinking about Seif, I was thinking, yeah, he's gonna be easy. But then I forgot, he does have like certain attacks that might one-shot me. And that's gonna really fucking be annoying. He might curse me as well, which would be really bad. So hopefully that doesn't happen. Obviously, Graveler Nito is going to give me a lot of trouble. I don't know, guys. This is, this is getting fucking really crazy. That's all I know. Anyway, I really do hope that you have enjoyed this. If you have, will you please like it? Be sure to subscribe if you haven't. And I really do hope that everyone has a very nice day. And poo so.